So now let's work with the list bot power up. So over here, you can see that there are a lot of cards and let's say that animatics is solely the responsibility of my other account. So in order, um, in order to assign all the cards in animatics, no matter how many cards you add on to it, you can use something called the list bot so that it automatically assigns uh, whatever card is in animatics to the other user. So I'm going to go to so many for that and then I'm going to go to power up from over here. So once I go into power up, I'm just going to type in list just like this until I get the list bot. So I'm just going to go around and click on this and click on add. So once I click on it, the list bot is there and you will have to authorize the list bot so that it works around with Trello. So you can see that these are the uh, things that the list bot will access. So I'm just going to uh, allow um, the access to the list bot. So once I do that, this is what I have in the list bot. So right now, my brainstorming is assigned to the list bot. So I'm just going to click on remove all and deactivate it because this is something that you'll see in your case. So let me just close this out. So in order to access the list bot, you can go over here onto the top, the list bot. So what I want to do is I want to assign the animatic. So I want to activate this so you can work around with multiple lists as well. And as soon as someone adds in a card to animatics, I want to assign it to the TutorTube2 account. So what happens is that I can just close this out. You can see that TutorTube2 is there now. I can add in multiple members if I want to as well. So I'm just going to close this. So once I close it, what I can do is if I were to move it from storyboard to animatics, now it has been assigned to TutorTube2 just like that. If I were to drag in this one, you can see TutorTube2 just in a while. Just drag that in and that's TutorTube2 just like that. That is what the list bot does. So that is how you can use the list bot power up to assign things automatically to different users inside of Trello. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.